the Human Resource Development Unit of the Ministry of Education serves the public in several ways. One of these services include the verification and certification of educational certificates. Daily, the unit receives a high volume of persons coming in to drop off the academic statement of results or completion of studies documents to get processed and certified a true copy. This is a critical role the unit plays as these certified copies are usually deemed mandatory for persons interested in applying for a job, attending university, or applying for a scholarship. More so, the unit provides this service to the entire nation. Secretary of the Human Resource Unit, Erlene Jules Justin, says as the unit continues to do its work and grow, so too is the backlog of certificates and certified copies that remain uncollected. In some cases, she says, certificates as far back as 2014 remain with the unit. We are urging the public to please collect your certificates because we have certificates um, in our cabinets for as far as 2014. And I think persons should be more responsible and make it a duty that they collect the certificates because if not, then we, we need storage. If not, those certificates may have to be sent to the archives. If not, then we'll have to send names out to the public and let persons know that they need to come to collect their certificates because it's taking up space and we don't want to be responsible for persons' important documents because we already played our part in stamping it and we need persons to play their part to collect it. Ms. Justin went on to explain that there is a process involved in certifying and verifying certificates and due diligence is their top priority. She also took the time to clear the air on some misconceptions the public may have with regards to the purview and responsibility of the unit. Persons will come in and say like, why can't you do it within a day? Why can't I collect it one time? Like I said before, it's a process. Some may require in-depth research, some may not, where we could just go to examinations and get the information and whatnot. But we, we persons have to understand Everything is a process, and we want to ensure that everything is done correctly and accurately. Um, also, when it comes to our scholarship offerings, some well, the public would think that we are the one responsible for um, selecting persons for scholarships. We are not the ones who give the final, make the final decision. It may go through cabinet. It may go through the awarding um, bodies. But it's not us, so we they have to understand it's not we're not the ones doing the selection. The HRD unit is responsible for processing long-term scholarships, economic cost awards, and the Sir Arthur Lewis bursary. They also process Caribbean single market and economy CSME certificates and endorse new educational facilities. From the Communications Unit of the Ministry of Education, Sustainable Development, Innovation, Science, Technology, and Vocational Training, I am Danielle Dubois reporting.